This is the AuthenticWatches.com instruction video for using the Tag Heuer Aqua Racer Automatic Chronograph. These models do feature a screw down crown, so to wind the watch you will first need to turn the crown counterclockwise until it pops out on its own. And once it has popped out, you can wind the crown by turning it clockwise 40 to 50 full rotations. Once you have fully wound the watch, it should move on its own for about 38 hours. To set the time on this watch, you will need to pull the crown out two clicks away from the winding position. One, two. Turning the crown clockwise will move the hands back. Turning the crown counterclockwise will move the hands forward. Before you can attempt to change the date, you will need to make sure that you're outside the time frame of the turn cycle, which is between the hours of 8 p.m. to 3 a.m. You may not remember this time frame, or you may not know whether you're in the AM or PM setting. The easy way around this is to make sure that both hands are pointing towards the 6 hour mark. Once both hands are pointing towards the 6 hour mark, you know that it is safe to change the date. You will change the date by going into the position between the winding position and the time setting position. This is also known as position one. The way that I will do this is by pushing the crown all the way in and then just pulling it out one click. Once you pull it out one click, you can advance the date by turning the crown clockwise. Turning the crown counterclockwise will not do anything in this case. You can only advance the date on this model. A common misconception with chronograph watches is that the longest Sweep hand is the normal seconds hand, but it is not. The normal seconds hand on any chronograph watch is going to be one of the smaller subdials. In this case, it's the right subdial. The other two subdials are the chronograph hours and the chronograph minutes. To use the chronograph feature on this watch, you will first press the top A button. Once you do so, you'll notice the chronograph seconds hands start to visibly move and the chronograph hours and minutes will gradually move over time. To stop the chronograph feature, you'll also press the top button. And to reset the chronograph feature, you'll press the bottom button, also known as the B button. Another nice feature of this watch is the unidirectional rotating bezel. The bezel can be rotated in the counterclockwise direction, but it cannot be bumped or moved back in the clockwise direction. And this is used specifically for the purposes of diving so that professional divers can measure how much oxygen they have left in their tank. And that is it. Thank you so much for watching. If you're interested in purchasing this watch or a similar watch from the collection, we have provided a link in the description below. If you enjoy these videos or if they're helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe. You can email us with any inquiries at sales at authenticwatches.com. Call us at 1-800-808-9928. Don't forget to like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter at AWInc1979. Thank you very much.